Welcome back to my channel. This is Roxanne from YouTube, back with another video. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And please push the bell notification to be notified when I come up with another video. I do apologize. There is construction work outside my house. So if you hear some weird old noises, that is not me. Okay, so I'm not sure what my neighbors are doing. Well, anyway, today this is a review um i of a free sample i received from box.com it's xx espresso i'm guessing that means a double shot espresso from khalifa nitro latte with oat milk yes you read that you read that and heard that right oat milk this is a vegan product i was not aware of that that's interesting smooth and frothy cold brew coffee seven fluid ounces 210 milliliters and here's the benefits that they're are touting vegan, nut-free, gluten-free, direct trade coffee, non-GMO verified, and please recycle. And it shows about, um, pardon me, and here is the ingredients and the nutrition facts. If you like to pause the video. And it's, it's cold. It's kind of getting warmer now, but it's still cold. And I will be back to try it and open it up one moment please so here i am back i'm about to open it and i got a disposable um cup reusable cup and the free sample products to try i'm doing this one-handed so please Oh my. They weren't lying when they said under pressure. Oh, and my cup is falling. That's not good now. They were not lying when they said under pressure on the on the cup label. I mean, it pretty much looks like regular coffee. It doesn't... Ooh, it really smells like espresso. Which, by the way, if you don't like coffee, you probably will not like this at all. But it could be good into, like, a recipe. I know some people... Which is... It's, it's strange. Some people don't like coffee, but they'll like coffee desserts... I know I have a few family and friends. There's like coffee ice cream and tiramisu. Those things all have coffee. I think they both have espresso coffee in them. And they love those things to death. Probably because there's like lots of stuff added into it. But anyway, I am going to give this a taste. One moment, please. I'll be off camera. So as you see, I did take a few sips of that. Um, I don't notice, actually, I'm not vegan, by the way, so there's that. But on a positive thing, I do not taste like, you know, if someone said, oh, there's milk in this. I wouldn't think one way or the other if it was real milk or not. It doesn't taste like, you know, it's not real milk. And let me go back to the nutritional I mean, there's 9 grams, 8 grams extra, um, added sugar. So, I mean, it's not the, it's not the, it's not the worst type of, it seems like there's more in here. So, it's not the worst drink ever. Um, and it's interesting that it's under pressure. I wonder why they did that. Because it says, um, if it would focus... Open carefully. It contains under pressure. Refrigerate after opening. Best serve chilled. So, it's interesting that they said it's under pressure. Maybe so, it's more like a regular type of coffee drink. You know, like Starbucks or whatever. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. And 
I know a lot of YouTubers rate stuff. I would give it out of 10. I would give it a 9 out of 10. It's pretty good. It's something different. Um, you really can't tell it's milk. Um, not milk. You can't tell that it's vegan, in my opinion. Um, but yeah. And the saturated is zero. The colors are pretty low. So, I mean, it's pretty good. I mean, I don't know what they could have do to get it better. But it's hard to give coffee drinks, in my opinion, 10 out of 10. Well, anyway, let me stop rambling on. And I appreciate you all for watching the video and staying up to date with my channel. Peace, love, and rock on. Roxanne out. Goodbye, y'all.